Hey everyone, this is Gina back. Gina Topia, how is all my Glam Fam? I want to show you what I used in the month of March and um, tell you whether I liked it or what, whether I didn't like it. First, I used up the De De uh, Design Line Silver Shine Shampoo that was recommended to me because I have uh, blonde hair. Um, it's supposed to make your hair blonde, or uh, yes, it does. It's a good product, but um, I need something with a little bit more moisturizing in my hair. But it is a good product, so I finished that up in March. Let me skip my camera back just a little bit. That way you can see me just a little bit better. Okay. Next, I finished up and used the whole Avon Makeup Remover Wipes. I love these. I've been using these for several years. I buy these for my niece because she loves them. These are great. One of my favorite products from Avon. Next, I used up a Suave Almond and Shea Butter Conditioner for a um, drugstore conditioner. This is a pretty good conditioner. I would buy it again. Not, not my favorite, but it is a pretty good conditioner. Then I used a Pantene uh, Moisture Renewal uh, Hydrating Shampoo. This is a good shampoo. I love Pantene products. I have nothing to say about bad about Pantene, so that's a good shampoo. And then I used up a Wynn Sweet Almond Mint um, Intensive Hair Treatment. I'm kind of iffy about Wynn products since there has been a lawsuit out about the hair loss from women about Wynn products. I lose a lot of hair anyway, so I don't know if Wynn caused it or not, but I used it, couldn't tell any difference in hair loss, so uh, it is a good intensive treatment. Then I used a Avon Clinical Eye Lift. I used that up. I've been working on that a while. It's not something I use regularly, so it was one of my, uh, out of my pan projects, so um, that'd be in my pan project thing. I also used out of one of my boxes that I got got the um, Divine OI Conditioner and Shampoo. These were just little full packets, but let me tell you, I was so excited when I got them because they were made in Italy and they were supposed to be uh, UVA ray protected and all this bunch of stuff. These things smell so bad, I gagged in the shower and couldn't wait to get them out of my hair. Uh, I have been using this spraying conditioner but it smells bad, but not as bad as this. Nasty, nasty, nasty. I don't know if I got a bad batch, but I would never buy that again. Horrible, horrible, horrible. That will go in my worst ever products. I also used up some Carol's Daughter Manoy Shampoo and the Repairing Shampoo and Repairing Conditioner. I love Carol's Daughter products. If you've never smelled them, they smell fantastic. I love this Manoy. I just needed something that was more moisturizing, but oh, I love the way they smell. And you just need the smallest amount of the shampoo to get massive amounts of, of, of setting. But it smells, oh, I love the way it smells. They made a, a perfume. I would wear that perfume because it just smells so good. But Carol's Daughter makes some really fantastic products. I do, I do like Carol's Daughter products. I also finished up the Carol's Daughter Manoy Body Repairing Transforming Share Milk. And I have bought another one of these because it makes your skin feel so silky soft. And again, it smells wonderful. I love that product. I also finished up a Corel hand and cuticle therapy. I use a lot of hand creams because I had extremely dry hands. I have uh, severe eczema, so I use a lot of hand creams and stuff. Um, Hypnostrama Mascara. Uh, it's my second favorite mascara. Um, makes beautiful lashes. If you've never tried Hypnostrama, you need to try that. It's good mascara. An Avon Moisture Effective uh, Eye Makeup Remover. There might be just a little bit, a little bit more in that. I might try to turn that upside down, try to get just a little bit more out of it. But that's a good eye makeup remover. Um, a, a Sea Island Cotton little um, lotion from uh, Bath and Body. A Signature Club A Night Cream, and this is. A really good night cream. If you've ever bought from HSN, this is one of their premium brands or one of their premium, um, yeah, brands that they have on there. 
And this is a really good night cream. I really like that night cream. I love that brand. In fact, I just placed an order for some of her stuff today. I also, um, ooh, that's messy. I shouldn't open that. Um, finished up a um, CoverGirl Simply Powder. I keep the, one of these in my desk or one of these in my vehicle because I don't like to keep a higher end one in my desk or in my vehicle because they get busted up like this one finally got busted up. Um, just for a touch up on my chin or my nose. Um, finished that up. I also finished up a Smooth Minerals Blush from Avon. And I also finished up a um, LA Colors lipstick and a Estee Lauder lipstick. And I finished up my Holy Grail eye primer. It's an Avon eye primer. It comes in a little glass uh, jar, a little glass pot. If you've never tried the Avon eye primer, you definitely need to try it. It will even make the cheapest eyeshadow last a lot longer. This is my Holy Grail eyeshadow or eye, eye primer. I love it. Love, love, love it. But that's what I finished up for the month of March. I didn't include toothpaste or um, bar soaps or hand soaps or anything like that in here because well, I just didn't because we all use those and I just didn't include those. But that's what I finished up for the month of March. I guess my favorite product that I finished up would probably be the uh, Manoy uh, Body Repair because I love the scent of that. When you use this, your whole bathroom just smells wonderful. And um, that's what I, what I finished up for the month of March. I will be doing this again for the month of April, so uh, stay tuned if you like this type of video. Uh, please click like if you like my channel. Please subscribe. And until the uh, n next month when I do another uh, finished up of my products, I'll be seeing you, seeing you with some other videos. And if you like my eyeshadow and my makeup look for today, this is all... Um, the, the peach palette and the uh, Too Faced look. So I'll be doing a tutorial on, on this look. So until then, I will see you and uh, let me show you this so you can get a close up on that brand. In case you're interested in buying this, they make all kinds of great products. This is Carol's Daughter. You can get it from HSN and you can also get it from your drugstore.